Those shots fired around 8 o'clock last night at the Foxborough Apartments. CBS 13's Brady Hound Live joining us live with how neighbors are reacting to this tonight, Brady. Well, Marley, I'm just outside of the Foxborough Apartments, and I'm told by neighbors that this is a fairly quiet community here, and uh, it's not uncommon to see children running around here, but of course, last night, that was a different story. Citrus Heights Police responded to shots fired to call around here um, at 8 p.m. last night. When officers arrived, they found a man with gunshot wounds. They provided life-saving support, but he was later transported to the hospital where he later died. Police have not yet released any information on the suspect or the victim, and right now, we're no arrests have been made, which is concerning news for Ashley Sanders, who lives here with two small children. That definitely makes me rethink where I'm living, especially with my children. Definitely an uncomfortable feeling, and I do not want to feel not safe where I live. So it's definitely concerning. Now, other neighbors in the area who didn't want to go on camera tell me this kind of event is very unusual for this community. Some residents didn't even know there was a shooting here last night. And as I mentioned earlier, no arrests have been made and the investigation is ongoing. Of course, we will keep you updated as we learn more. Marley. I can certainly understand people being upset in that area. Brady, thank you for that live report.